Good afternoon. I am standing in front of 13611 uh, Elmwood. It is a Gemini twin home, so it is connected with one wall and they mirror each other. There is an HOA on this property of $250 per month. It includes blanket insurance, exterior maintenance, um, pest control, trash, water sewer, um, but it does not include the roof repair, roof replacement. So just one house and then um, it is Thunderbird. Um, I will tell you that it is a main road throughout the community. So it is highly trafficked, trafficked, traveled. So you are surrounded by Gemini twin homes in this section here. So not a garage, a carport, double carport. Um, we have several ac uh, entrances to the property here. This, I will see if my key works for it and see if that opens up. Um, it is a storage unit. I don't think it does. Maybe. There we go. There we go. Goodness gracious, we'll get it together here. Okay, so we transition from um, the cement to uh, like an outdoor carpet. And it looks like pink walls in here. Washer and dryer, lots of storage. Hot water heater. Just another entrance into the home. So you have to go outside to get to this, which is nice. And here's just that other entrance. Get you into the little dining and kitchen area. You have a nice fully gated patio here. Transition to pavers. You also have access um, out and in through that little gate too. front door and a slider outside the dining room. There's some stained glass work here, purple and green. We transition into tile here. It's about 12 inch tiles. The color choice is definitely different, purple. We have a pocket door here. We'll go this way first. So the cabinets are really nice. I feel like they've definitely been upgraded. Window coverings look new, newer. They have put in some of these um, floodlights, but they, or um, skylight things, but they didn't remove the crown molding here. I'm not sure about that. Appliances look to be newer. They're frigid air. Just a little cleaning needed, not much. There's a pantry here. Um, the countertops are a solid surface. They're not granite. This is in a very big area, so you could maybe do like a round table and a few chairs or a little rectangle or square chair. It's not very big here, but it is lets lots of light in from outside there. Again, another pocket door here to close off the kitchen. Um, the, the carpet's pretty soiled. It would probably need to be replaced. I don't know if a carpet cleaner would be able to get that out or not. Um, this color wall is more, it's so hard to see in here. I'm sorry, it's, they don't have great lighting. Um, does that help? No, here, it's blue. It is a baby blue, almost like a sea blue. Um, but again, the paint has definitely uh, seen better days. 
So I think I would just repaint it. Maybe you can see, oh, there you go. You can kind of see better there, I think. This is a good size room. Um, and then it transitions um, into this, almost like this extra Arizona room, extra living area. It is fully enclosed. Um, it does have the popcorn ceilings. I'm not sure what they use this area for, but again, this, the carpet's pretty soiled and this is a very bright yellow ceiling fan. So I don't see an AC register out here. So this part might get a little bit warmer, although I'm, I know it's open to this area. It just might take a while for this area to cool off. So while we're back here, I will show you the outside. It's a cute little patio area. So the rest of this is all taken care of by that HOA fee. It seems to be some type of fruit tree here, a big fruit tree here. The electrical panel and the hose are on this side, on the shared wall side. The roof is a um, shingle roof. I'm not sure if we can see the AC unit or not. Let's go out here and see if we can. This is the side of the house. Ugh, I'm not tall enough. I don't know if you can even see it up there. It doesn't seem to be a newer unit. I'd have to get more information on that for you. Okay, let's check out the bedrooms and the bathrooms. This door seems to be newer and it slides really easy. Okay, so these are French doors that go into the master. And the master, um, I believe, you know what, I don't know if it's the same blue in the other room or not. It looks to be a little bit more green to me, sea foamish color. Um, so if I stand here, you, you can kind of see it's dark in here because the ceiling fan doesn't have a light in it. It just has one light. So um, I'll do my best here. There is some type of there. So there's mirrors on the wall here. This seems to be some type of um, uh, wallpaper. There is this built-in area here, which seems to be a little bit newer too. And it's the same solid surface that's in the kitchen, which is nice. Lots of storage here. Yeah, there does seem to be a light switch here. So see a light source here. There it is. Okay, maybe that helps a little bit. So that's a real cute area there. And then you have the master closet which again, back then they didn't have much storage space. So unfortunately, that's kind of all you got in this one. Again, a pocket door. They are all flat doors. All the doors are flat. There's another door. Then this door is painted, yeah, it's sea foam green. You have the um, shower tub combo and again that same wallpaper that was over as an accent in the master. I'm not really sure what oh, what's going on there. Um, the tub has like these speckled glitter in it a little bit.
And these are the, the 12 inch tiles as well. So then we're gonna go to this little hall. And this color is um, not salmon, not coral, like a burnt orange, I'm not really sure what to call it, but you have more storage here. You have a laundry hamper. And then this is the secondary, and you can tell that this shower has been updated. Looks clean, a new shower head. Again, tile. And then the secondary bedroom, which is actually a really good size. This is a periwinkle blue. And then this is all built in. So it's kind of nice that it's, it looks like more storage than almost the master. These are very deep. We're facing the front of the house here. And then it's just kind of a circle. There's your register. So then we're back to the front entry. And got a storage closet here. And then if I turn it around this way, it's back to that main living area. So I think this is a cute house. I think the colors throw it off a little bit. So I think if you painted it a new, more neutral color, um, it would definitely be more appealing. Um, and I do think the carpet needs to be replaced or deep cleaned. Um, but yeah, I don't see anything, any major red flags. There you go.